of the ball, and we are under a minute and 30. Trying to drive, closing it up well are the Cougars, and a bad pass to Turnover! Stanky, no, Burkholder. Burkholder, they're gonna call a foul. That'll be the third foul on Mike Burkholder, and that'll put Chris Dillon, the three-point specialist for the Craig Cougars, though we haven't seen many threes uh, out of him tonight. That's because he hit five Tuesday night. He's, he's taken the night off. He's taken, yeah, he did hit five there on Tuesday night against Madison West. I think he had another, uh, or no, uh, or East, Madison East. Madison East. Yeah, wrong side of town. He had three threes against Memorial and two threes against Oregon also. Good ball movement still by the Vikings. They've had that all game. Minute to go. Long shot, number 45, score it. Nick Knuth under a minute. It's a four point ball game. The Cougars on top just barely holding on here. Next two points will reach their team, uh, year average. And they are going to force the Vikings to foul. And they get it. Boy, they did some good uh, ball movement to keep the foul from coming, but the Vikings managed to stop the clock now with a four point deficit. But the Cougars could add to that. And who do you foul? They don't have many bad free throw shooters on the Craig Cougars, but then he does foul one of the better ones. <laughs> of course, they didn't give him the choice either. Yeah. That puts a six point lead on the board for the Craig Cougars at 72, 66, 27 seconds left. The Cougar Vikings need to battle uphill now. The Craig Cougars on the rebound on a missed shot by Knuth. 20 seconds left. It's a 72, 66 ball game. Six points by the Cougars. And uh, probably what will be the final timeout of the game called by the Janesville Parker coach, Bob Luxinger. And uh, speaking, well, mentioning that name reminds me that uh, next week's game we want to tell you about is going to be a big one in the Big 8 girls division. It'll be the Parker Vikings hosting the Sun Prairie Cardinals. And as we all know, it is the Sun Prairie Cardinals that have been the rivalry in the Big 8 Girls Basketball Conference. Last year, Sun Prairie beat the Parker Vikings two times. Their only two losses of the year until they got all the way to the state final. And that put Parker in second place in the division. So we're gonna see a good one next week. Sun Prairie Cardinals and Parker Viking Girls at Parker next Saturday morning at 9.30 on Marcus Cable Channel 20. And he scores both of them, adding to the lead, and we are down to 17 seconds. Nine seconds as the whistle blows. I thought the uh, Cougars are gonna put the camper on there. But they've opened up the distance now, and uh, might as well say have won the game as the Vikings maintain the lead for two and a half quarters. At the line for the Cougars, Austin Latka. 
played uh, pretty much throughout the game, uh, probably just took a couple of breathers, but he's been in there the entire game. He's been a force, let's say the least. Been at the free throw line a lot also. That's right. And uh, Vikings with three, Point three seconds draw foul, and that'll put Knuth to the line. Nick Knuth, a 6'1 junior. He started tonight at the guard position for the Vikings. Number 40, Troy Cruiser, a senior, checking into the Craig lineup for the final few seconds. Yeah, after these, uh, this free throw, whether it's made or not, it's not much left of this game. Adds one for the Vikings. Boy, the Vikings played a great game tonight. It's one of those that you hate to see either team lose. And we're down to the end of the game as the Cougars all, all, the, uh, all they have to do is hold on the ball, which they did. So at the end of the game here at Craig High School, it is won by the Craig Cougars over the Parker Vikings by a score of 75 to 68. We'll be back with a wrap up of tonight's game after this as you're watching the Big 8 Conference on Marcus Media Sports.